All right, my one rental at a time family. Omar Alfaro here again. This is property number two in the city of Yucca Valley. The first one was in Landers. This one's in Yucca Valley, California. Check this out. So this is the front of the house. Two car garage, completely redone. Pretty cool black door. Now you're walking in, look at this. Completely open. We got vinyl flooring, we got cool furniture, we got a pretty badass kitchen. Look at this. Galley kitchen. We got the butcher block countertops. We got the floating shelves. We got the hood. We got washer and dryer underneath, so it's perfect area for them. Farmhouse sink. Samsung appliances. We got like a saltillo tile room here off of the kitchen, which is pretty sweet. We got a wood burning stove. We got a, a pretty awesome patio cover with awesome views. We got some concrete steps to your spa and then an area for you to hang out in the evening. Just a great property. Now let's take a look at the rest. So we got the hallway. We got one of the bathrooms. One bedroom, another bedroom, a third bedroom, all have ceiling fans. This is the master. Master's pretty big. Look at our uh, our vanity here. This is a cool spot. And we got the master shower. All custom tile. We got the stacked um, subway tile, decorative in the back all the way through. Good property. Turned out beautiful. All right guys, so the numbers on this property. We paid 205 for this house, uh, four bedroom, two bath. We had to re-gut the whole place. We did the flooring, we did the paint, we did countertops, we did counters, the whole works. And we got a new, um, installing a new AC system as well because it is pretty hot, but you know, not it's not that bad right now. But the numbers are 210, or no, 205 to purchase. We're in this thing about 65K, maybe 70 even. So now we're at about a $275,000 all in price. This property here is worth 499 all day because of the location that it's in. And um, we can either burr it or we're gonna keep it as a short term vacation rental because the desirability and the demand is super high right now. So those are the numbers. We're gonna hopefully get a good 15 to 18% return uh, on our yield, maybe a little bit more, but maybe we might just have it for a year. And um, after the year, I might sell it. So now the long-term capital gains come into effect versus the short-term. So, or I might just keep it and have somebody else pay the mortgage so I can get that principal pay down and have another asset so I can leave my kids uh, refinance it, you know, go buy a nice Lambo or a Ferrari or something like that. I don't know, whatever comes to mind later on. So guys, we got one more house after this one. So I just wanted to share with you our like finished results on these last two projects. The next one is we're in project or we're in the progress of rehabbing them now. So um, stay tuned. See ya.